Hi, welcome to Hard Wrist Info. In front of me, iPhone 17 Pro Max, and now I'm gonna show you how to fix if Apple Intelligence is not working in your region. I live in Poland, and officially, Apple Intelligence is not released in my country. And uh, unfortunately, there is no way to change region in settings while you. Uh, select the country, um, different country um, during startup. So, as you can see, for example, in my case, I'm trying to open uh, Visual Intelligence, it's not working. Apple Intelligence is not working when I'm trying to uh, use it using a special button dedicated for it. As you can see, it's uh, constantly downloading support. Uh, playground is not working too. Oh, playground is working. Okay, it's pretty good. Um, Apple features in Notes are not working too. So how to fix that? So uh, to do that, we just should open Settings, then click General, then scroll down again, click Transfer or Reset an iPhone, click Erase all content and data, and it will remove everything from your device. Really everything. So, you can click continue, erase, erase iPhone. If you want to back up your data to not to uh, just, um, you know, remove everything forever, uh, you can back up data from your device. So, firstly, of course, uh, you can back up all data, then you can confirm the password. I will pause my video for a while. OK, then click OK. Ah, okay. So now just wait a while. Okay, here we are, and now we should uh, just set up our device. But the most important thing should we do uh, is to uh, select English language. Now scroll a bit down, maybe scroll down just. And here select United States. It's a very important step because if you will activate uh, your device with United States, you will have Apple Intelligence just because you will um, you will set up Apple Intelligence during setup, not in system. Okay, so select the network you want to connect. Click next, wait a while, okay, wait a while again, click continue, adult, you can set up face ID, I recommend you set up face ID on this step. Okay. Create a passcode. If you want to transfer, you can transfer everything from different device. And now the most important part, login into your Apple account. Click login. It will ask you about the code. Okay, here we are, click Agree. Wait a while. Okay, click Continue. I will stop Teller later. Apple Pay, you can set up now, but now the most important part Click set up Apple Intelligence, choose notification to summarize if you want to summarize. Uh, you can turn on priority notification, uh, disable it. And now, very important, click light press to adjust zoom, click continue, continue. Now you can customize your uh, action button. Click continue again. Wait a while.
cool. Now you can share audio recordings. I suggest you not to share, of course. And get started. And now we can open settings. Then open Apple Intelligence and Siri and... Okay. And now just wait a while and after a while we will have all um, all Apple intelligence features here. Just wait a while. First, open uh, App Store, click Continue, Hello, everything, go back, then open Settings, click Finish, set up your phone. If you want, you can uh, set up now uh, your Apple Pay. So now we just should wait a while until uh, Apple Intelligence uh, is downloading. So just wait, wait a while. Okay, after a few minutes you will have installed Apple uh, Playground. Uh, you will have installed everything here, as you can see, uh, you know, uh, below Apple Intelligence and Siri, now you have all installed. Uh, you can check out my time, how long it takes uh, to me. Uh, so cool, then you should open notes and click uh, yes, 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 I agree, agree, agree. And now you will have Apple Intelligence, but first you should open settings. Then in settings, find Apple Intelligence again. Here, scroll bit down, select ChatGPT, click use ChatGPT, next, enable. Uh, then click sign in, sign in to ChatGPT using your account. Okay. It looks to be easier than a face ID. Okay, okay, so now I have everything here. And, um, and nice, now we can use um, almost everything but to use everything you should open a photo a gallery then click on the um, edit button and click clean up wait a while to prepare clean up wait a while it can take a while Cool, and now we can use even Magic Eraser from Apple. It works worse than any other Magic Eraser, but okay, it works, and it's cool. On the on, it, it works, but even on the white background, uh, even on the white white uh, background, as you can see. So uh, maybe it's useless, but now you can use uh, Image Playground. For example, I don't know. Uh, sad Bowie sci-fi at the street, for example. Wait a while and you can generate strange images using not too good... Uh, okay, choose a person to include in this image. Okay, so by the way, it works. Uh, you can now use it in the notes. For example, I don't know how. Hi, everybody, and welcome. For example, right? I will remove everything from this note. And for example, I can select the text. And here I have OpenAI ChatGPT AI tools. Now we can, for example, extend this text. Click OK. Click uh, just write extend or what you want to do with this text and it will do. Uh, then you can click OK. Then you can select the text and ask AI to um, summarize, for example. Here you have summary. OK, copy. Paste. 
Okay. So what's next? So we can ask Siri for something. Hey Siri, what the weather in uh, I don't know New York today? What you didn't get? What the weather in New York? How are you? Open wiki. I don't know why it's not working too good. Open wiki. It should work uh, correct, but now I don't know why it's not working too good, but, but it works. Okay, it's Apple intelligence. It's not too good enough, um, but it works. Uh, then what we can do next? Uh, next we can use our uh, visual intelligence. You can bind it to, to this button. I don't know why it's not working for now, but we can activate it manually here. Click plus button, add control. Uh, right here, visual intelligence. Select this widget, click on it, and it works. Click continue. And now, for example, you can uh, translate text with easily for example just take a photo of the text you want to translate and uh, it will automatically detect everything you have here if it's just a text in different language it will ask you to translate uh, it will extract all uh, websites you have here even emails if you want to email someone so it's really helpful you can translate it fastly click continue and as you can see, it translates it translates everything from all languages to to English. Uh, you can even ask with ChatGPT, and you can ask, "What is this? What is it?" Okay, this is a package of pistachio cream filled. Uh, how many calories uh, does it have? How many calories? It's working. This pistachio cream watch rolls contain. Okay, as you can see. Um, is it too much sugar here? Hey, ChatGPT, is it too much sugar here? Okay, as you can see it works, maybe it's not too good enough, but but it works and it's most important. So um, we can even search on the photos, for example, for, for, for some things. Uh, I don't know, um, for example, I have, I don't know what I have. For example, you can, oh, okay, here I have a flower, okay? So I can take a photo of the flower then click search and it will search for flowers uh, using Google Lens. Uh, yeah, I know it's a bit strange, but it works. So, thanks. Thanks for watching. Hope this video was helpful for you guys. Um, if it's true, please consider to leave a like and a comment below. See you.